Hello there, my name's Gary Jackson. I'm the president of the Canterbury Mustang Owners Club, but I'm with you here today for a more special reason, very close to my heart, because this is one of the world's oldest classic Mustangs. And myself and my wife, we've owned this car here in New Zealand since 2007. The car itself has a fascinating history, and we'll talk about that in a moment. But the big thing about this car is its absolute originality. It's an unrestored classic April build, early April build, 1964 Mustang, sold on launch day, April 17, 1964, to a young lady called Denise Monty, and you'll meet her in a moment. And she owned the car for 40 years, did only 47,000 miles in the car, and then it came to New Zealand through a wholesaler who bought the car in Las Vegas when Denise sold it, and we basically have owned the car since then. It has just turned 53,000 original miles. It's a fabulous car. It's Wimbledon white, white wall tires, Mustang notchback, exactly the same shape, the same style, the same color as all of the original Mustang advertising that kicked off 59 years of the Mustang legend back in 1964. And the originality of this car is, is really, it's, it's absolute, it's a treasure. Because here under the bonnet, you'll see it's got the original 260 V8, long before Ford bored the 260 out to become the world famous 289. It's an, as I say, early build car. It came offline in the production plant on April the 6th, 1964. That's on the door plate of the car and its originality and, and, and its age of the car is probably given away by the fact it's still got a generator. And the, the car itself and its condition is such, you can find the odd early Mustang with a generator, but this rubber um, uh, protection flap on the back of the generator to stop water splash on any other generator I've ever seen has long gone. Here it is still in its original shape so as you can see very original and true to its original build i mentioned denise monty here are some photos of denise monty denise and her husband were a famous stage act in the u.s called the agostinos a stage um uh, acrobatic act i think you call it and in fact you'll see in the photos that that, that with this car and all of its history of course is in a book that comes with the car. But there are photos of Denise with Muhammad Ali, Ed Sullivan, Johnny Carson, Sammy Davis Jr. and others. So even Denise herself, as well as the car being famous and original, Denise herself has her own story. The car itself is original. It's been regularly serviced and routine maintenance has been done on things such as ball joints and spring settings and, 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 and brakes and so on. But the originality is that it's never been rebuilt. It's rust free. It has its original paint right down to the fact it's a little thin on the edges, but the gloss is in fact is still as good as the brand new Mustang sitting beside it, in my view anyway. White wall tires, classic Mustang shape, originality from the 60s, these stick on body side moldings that were all the rage in the 60s and the early 70s. We, we have left all of that as part of the car. Would not want to have changed a thing. Inside the car, you can see again, the, um, the originality, the fact that it is in superb condition. If I just sit inside here for a moment, what you see is some real throwbacks to the 60s. It still has Denise's original steering wheel glove on the on the wheel um, and I was tempted to throw it take it off and take it away throw it away but haven't done that because of the original nature of it and in terms of Denise Denise still rides in the car because as we've come to understand she put this this um, imitation rose uh, artificial rose in the car as part of her touch on the car and it actually still sits there today it, the car itself has options. It's, it's auto, power steer, power brakes, drum brakes, power drum brakes, 
and it had the factory option of the full chrome console which adds a little bit to the interior as well so i hope you like the car i hope you like the mustang story because this is as far back in the mustang story as you can go back april 6 1964 production and sold on launch day april 17 1964. sadly as my life circumstances have changed we're now putting this car on the market through this great dealership team hutchison ford and this i guess is your chance to join the history of this car own it in your collection and treasure it for the years ahead best wishes thanks for watching